All right, hello, good morning to every one of you here. Now, we're going to discuss the grade 7 topic about substances and mixtures. The learning competency that we need to accomplish this morning is all about distinguishing mixtures from substances based on a set of properties. All right, so in grade 7 learning materials, guys, you have to, in the first activity, you have to... Um, Using seawater, you are going to separate its components. All right. In the second activity, you are to discover the behavior uh, between substances and mixtures by boiling and melting. All right. And in the third activity, you have to distinguish a certain um, a material if it is a mixture of substance. Because there are mixtures that are homogeneous which may be mistaken as substances. So you are going to either boil it or melt it. It depends. If it's a liquid, then you are going to boil it. If it's a solid material, then you are going to melt it. Because there is a corresponding behavior, boiling and melting behavior of a certain pure substance. Alright? Of, of a different behavior in boiling and melting of a mixture so you can differentiate them now let's go to our topic sea water cooking oil steel bronze oxygen salt soil when you look at these things individually do you think that you can recognize whether they fall under the pure substance or mixture category let us learn about the distinct differences and similarities, if any, between a pure substance and a mixture. Firstly, a pure substance is matter which cannot be separated into any other kind of matter when using the physical or chemical process. All the particles which make up a pure substance have the same color, taste, composition, and texture. In other words, it can be an element or a compound which consists of only one component with a definite composition, chemical, and physical properties. Secondly, a mixture is a combination of two or more substances which are not united using a chemical procedure. The components that make up a mixture do not exist in a fixed proportion and most of the natural substances that you are familiar with are mixtures. Examples of mixtures include water, alcohol, oil, and dye. So what are the distinct differences between these two? With regards to a mixture, it can be physically separated into pure compounds or elements. This is something that is not possible with a pure substance because it is already a type of matter which exists in its most basic or purest form. Another distinct characteristic of a pure substance is that no matter how physically impossible it may be to isolate a pure substance, it can only be considered as pure if no impurities are detected. When it comes to their physical properties, such as their boiling or melting points, pure substances are non-changing, while mixtures are varying. For example, the boiling point of pure water is at 100 degrees Celsius, while the boiling point of alcohol mixed with water may be at a range of temperatures. To put it simply, pure substances are exactly what the name implies, pure, while mixtures are impure. I hope we are um, enlightened by that uh, idea, guys. 